Today I'm going to teach you how to quickly create guitar tablatures using this app and Guitar Pro 6. And now here you get to choose the duration of your notes. You can click on them to choose them or you can use the plus and minus sign to quickly switch between them. Next you're going to click on sound and MIDI capture and choose the right device and this is the right one. Okay. When you're ready you tap on the record. I'm done here and I'm gonna stop the capture and now let's look at what I've done here okay notice everything is captured in eighth notes so that's not correct because the beginning it's actually faster these two are 16 notes so now you have to correct your notes using the mouse and the keyboard okay so these two notes push the plus sign to make them 16 notes okay I'm gonna insert a new bar here so go right click bar and then insert a new bar Okay, I'm going to grab these three notes and put them, copy and paste, actually cut them, cut, paste them in this bar. Okay, and before this, uh, these notes, there are three rests, so you're going to insert three rests. You can do that by using note and, uh, you know, insert a beat. Or you can simply use a control plus on the Mac. So you got three silent beats here. And they're all full notes so I'm gonna put minus minus to make them uh, quarter notes okay so that makes one measure because you need four quarter notes to make one measure and now uh, notice this one is short now uh, this this measure is lacking some notes because I've taken some notes and put them onto this measure here so I need to fix that but first uh, before I do that I gotta fix these three notes because they're 16th notes so plus two press the plus sign to make them faster and now you use the magic of Guitar Pro 6 uh, called the Bar Arranger under Tools click on that it's gonna correct everything for you okay so now you play it back sounds pretty good already but still something's wrong here this should not be here it should be somewhere here I'm going to make this a whole note, a uh, quarter note, this one too. And then I'm going to do bar arranger again. It's going to move everything back for me. And that's going to sound much better now. Perfect, right? That's perfect. And uh, let me copy these three notes them here paste them here and uh, I think we get rid of this note you don't need that note make this a whole note and then fix it take this out you ace these here you don't need them Uh, we can add that note back if we want. This is this right here. This is a quarter note, an eighth note. Okay, now, now we can just copy and paste this whole section here and put them here. And uh, there you go, you got two verses. Actually, the second verse, this note is not played. It's actually here. That's the only difference. OK, 
Okay, I'm going to make this a little longer. And play the next part. Okay, actually this last note is a quarter note. So slow that down, go to the next measure, set it back to eighth note. Same here, this is a eighth note, a quarter note. Again, the last note is a quarter note. Slow it down, next measure, and the last part. And then we just copy and paste what we had here. Just do up to here. We should copy and paste to the next measure. I just want this part to be in the previous measure. So I go here, move this out, stop capturing right now. Put it right here. Well, this should be a, I mean, a quarter note right here. So. Okay, now I don't need this measure now. I just go here, select this, right click and delete the bar okay and this part is different so I'm going to erase that and capture again make sure we're using eighth notes right here Okay, record. Okay, see how that sounds. longer here we don't need this note it's an extra note we don't need so we okay this one's gonna be longer okay add a dot here to make it longer and that's it that's your song right there I just tabbed it right in front of you sound better these are actually strummed so you go control D and it simulates a strum a brush so we're gonna choose this duration here so see how that sounds sounds pretty good so we're gonna keep that there and all these uh, chords here they're strummed not plucked at the same time all those notes are not plucked so this will simulate strumming down and 
and you're going to do that with all the chords that you have. Just strum them all. So with uh, A plus MIDI guitar, you get a very affordable uh, MIDI guitar controller that works with Guitar Pro 6 to help you tab your songs very quickly. I just did the song in about 15 minutes now. So let's go. Thanks for watching. I hope this has helped you and uh, I'll do more videos on how to use this wonderful app here. See you next time.